Yo, what is up, YouTube? This is Pure Kicks, back with another performance review. Yo, bro, why, why are you wearing a shirt, bro? Oh, this? Pure Kicks, why are you wearing a shirt? No, it's playoff season, baby. Gotta come correct. Don't look sweet. Don't look sweet. Now you lot see what I deal with on a daily. Don't look sweet. Yo, what is up, YouTube? This is Pure Kicks, back with another performance review. And as you guys can see by the title, today we're taking a look at the LeBron Soldier 12s. Let's get it. First and foremost, thank you very much to the guys over at Pro Direct for sending this amazing shoe over to us. We were very excited to get these shoes and test them on court. Cannot wait to let you guys know what we think of the shoe. So for those who don't know, the LeBron Soldiers is LeBron's second line of shoes, originally released as LeBron's budget model line. Mm -hmm. Lower but tier. Yeah. now it's come to a certain level where I think people prefer the LeBron Soldiers over LeBron's mm -hmm. actual Perhaps. current line. And we've got some amazing things to say about the shoe. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. So first and foremost, before we get into the performance of the LeBron Soldier 12, talking about how the shoe looks to me, what do you think about the aesthetics of the shoe? I'm messing with them. Yeah. I'm messing with them. I do like the way they look. Uh, it looks like a great revolution of the Soldier line. We've known it to have the straps and it's been continuing with that same kind of model. And the way they've kind of changed it this time around, I'm messing with. And this colorway, also clean. Also very clean. Almost the OG soldier colorway, if you will. Yeah, for those who know their soldiers, for those who know LeBron. So starting out with our favorite part of the shoe, the traction. Now, what are you calling it, Flo? Give it a name. I'm gonna call it Racetrack Herringbone. Racetrack Herringbone, you heard it here first. So Racetrack Herringbone performed like LeBron. Surprisingly, bro. Surprisingly performed just like LeBron. So well, very, very well. It really bit the floor on so many different courts as well. Yeah. Mildly dusty, very dusty, or completely clean. I don't know why I did it in that order. Could have just done the other way, but you know, yeah. I'm gonna move on. But absolutely killed it. We've got that wraparound traction as well we've seen on yeah. other lines, which does the trick. You do get that kind of drag traction. Step backs, twist turns, defensive slides, taken care of in this traction. That's one of the most important things to myself when it comes to my game, I'm sure to you as well. Most 100%. ballers, so yeah. Traction banged. What I like about the traction pattern as well is that we've seen in the NBA a lot of guards actually wearing the LeBron soldiers as well. You look at players like Markel Fultz, yep. we've seen many times wearing the LeBron soldiers, and you can see that they've actually, you know, ad pretty much adjusted the traction pattern oh, yeah. to kind of cater for all types of players. Mm. And that's it's, it's amazing to see, and the traction was fantastic. And they've done it, they've done just that. So to give it a score, I'm gonna give it a nine. That's I'm gonna give it a nine. Strong score. It's up know. there with a few goats we've already talked about. Yeah, that's very, very high, bro. It's a nine. It's very, a nine. very that's high. That's a good ass direction. Before we move on to our next favorite part of the shoe, would we recommend this shoe outdoors? Yes. Yes, we would. Why? Hard rubber, deep grooves is basically the two things you need when we're talking an outdoor shoe. You're gonna be taken care of, especially this colorway. I don't know, I haven't seen any translucence, but hard rubber sole, deep grooves. What more do you want? Now, moving on to our next favorite part of the shoe, it's gotta be the cushioning to me. The cushioning in this shoe is fantastic. Probably my favorite cushioning system that Nike has to offer. We've got a Phylon carrier mm -hmm. with a four foot zoom unit and a heel zoom unit. It's not full length. Pretty much is full length. It feels that way. Four foot zoom, heel zoom, you can't go wrong. Can't. For those of us that are team four foot zoom, team four foot zoom, you're taken care of. For those of you, I don't know who you are, that like heel zoom, you're also taken care of. Sick. <laughs> <I can't say. laughs> and for the special individuals out there that prefer heel zoom over four foot zoom, you're also taken care of. Special. Very special. The cushioning is just brilliant to me. Heel to toe transition is fantastic. Yep. Impact protection, you're taken care of. No more. Responsiveness, that's what Zoom is here for, response. Taken care of. Court feel isn't there that much, mm -hmm. but what do you expect from a LeBron shoe, do you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> Who cares about court feel when you have the cushion system that, that feels this good? Yeah. It's not quite a nine out of 10. No. Eight out of 10. Yeah, I agree with it's that. It's gotta be eight out of 10. The it's cushion in this shoe is sublime. So our next favorite thing is the fit. Now, it did the trick. What are you doing? Fit in it. It's the way the shoe fits. On your hand. My fault, my fault, my fault. The LeBron Soldier 12 fits like an absolute glove. Seamless. You killed it. 
Seamless. Seamless fitting shoe. It's easy on, it's easy off. It feels super, super nice. The fit is partnered with definitely the materials of the upper, which we'll talk about a bit more later, which does feel great around the foot, along with the straps that are there. So it also holds the foot really well, but we'll talk more about that a little bit later. Yeah, but yeah. when we're talking once the shoe is on, it fits amazingly. Yeah, once the shoe is on and you're strapped in, and minimal breaking time as well. Minimal breaking. It just fits really nice. You guys know I'm team one to one fit. One to one fits. The one to one fit in the LeBron 12, the LeBron Soldier 12, sorry, is fantastic. Now I've got what you would call a bit of a wide foot. So usually in my shoes I go up half a size. Timmy has what you would call a regular foot. Regular foot. For your regular folks. I'm a size 10 and the size 10 was perfect. Timmy's a 12. Yeah. The 12 was perfect. So whatever size you usually get. Yeah, I think it'd be fine. The way this shoe fits is is seamless. But that all said, the fit's got to be eight out of ten. It's got to be eight. It's got to be straight it's eight. Be eight. It's no, it's not good. quite nine. It's not quite ten. Tens don't really exist. For yeah. Tall, tall, tall. But an eight, most definitely, most definitely. So next up, when it comes to the support of the LeBron Soldier Twelves, we have our usual suspects in the heel. We have your heel counter to help with heel containment. We have the outrigger of the shoe to prevent any excessive lateral movement. Um, and we have the overall fit and the way the shoe locks down. Now, don't be misled by the high top ankle collar of the shoe. It's basically a sock-like fit. That's right. So it feels like a low top, It does. I would say, but looks obviously like a high top. The, the support in the shoe was good. It was really good. Once your foot is locked down, Again. we'll talk about the materials in a second. Once your foot is locked down and you are strapped in, the fit is good. It's not, you know, it's not a screamer. It's not amazing support, it's good. but it gets the job done. The LeBron soldiers traditionally are known as a shoe that have optimum support. Do optimum. You know I mean? So you, the thing optimum. that we were expecting the shoe to have was 10 out of 10 support yeah. and the traction to not be as great. But surprisingly, it's on the flip side. The traction right. is really amazing, and the, the support is average. I you think say. that goes back to what you mentioned about traction being, or even just a shoe being more not leading towards guards? I think what they've tried to do here is kind of make the shoe more balanced for all mm -hmm. positions, and I think they have achieved that. I agree. I mean, they've you know laid down a little bit so the shoe is not as supportive and not as not too restrictive. That's it. Yeah. But it's still there and it still makes sure your foot is locked in so the support is very good you know with that all being said I mean, the support has to be a 7 out of 10 I agree it's a very it's very average, good support yeah it's not incredible and last maybe least I don't know last but not least I guess in this case um, Timmy you know what the floor's yours Timmy You're, you can be the bearer of bad news You know them ones. The material is trash. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. So when we say trash, we don't mean it's uncomfortable. We don't mean it's bad. We just mean there's a few things that were quite annoying about the issue. Which actually took a toll on the experience of the issue. Mm -hmm. First one is the straps. The straps, the straps. LeBron is a big player. His shoe is a big shoe designed for a high intensity workouts, high intensity gameplay. These straps weren't holding up. They just weren't, they refused. They were popping like they were never there in the first place. Once time you strap in, wow. Yeah. Wow, but the only problem is it doesn't stay there. As for the upper materials, we see that leather toe box along with this mesh construction for the rest of the shoe. Even though mesh, there is no ventilation. This shoe's hot. Hot feet. Real quick. Smelly, smelly. Wow. <laughs> if it all came together perfectly, we'd be talking very, very differently. 100%. But when we go back to how good the traction was, whereas the Velcro materials and the straps don't hold up, when you've got a traction that good and the Velcro won't stay, it becomes a very annoying shoe to play in. Yeah. Unfortunately, because it is a great shoe, it's just a little annoying. So with that all being said, the materials, Timmy? Comes in at a five. Five. Is that the first five we've seen on here? Maybe, you know. It might be the first five we've seen. And that's, again, we have to be very, very clear here. It's not a knock at the whole shoe. No way. The shoe itself is a fantastic shoe. It just has an annoying aspect to it. Pretty much, yeah. Kind of like girls. 
<laughs> so overall, looking at the scores of the LeBron Soldier 12s, it comes in at a 7.4 out of 10. That is a very good score. Strong score. The traction was fantastic. It surprised us. It was so good. Bit the floor so, so well. The cushioning, you can't go wrong with four foot and heel zoom. It just feels amazing. The fit of the shoe was brilliant and the support was good. It was just let down by the materials of the shoe. But overall, the shoe is a very good shoe to play in. And of course, before we go, another massive thank you to ProDirect for sending these through. If you're interested in picking up a pair for yourself, hit the link in the description. This colorway specifically will be available on the 31st, but right now there's a few colorways on there which also do look pretty clean, very clean, can't, can't lie. So you can either go over there or even wait for the 31st and pick up this colorway. So all right guys, that's it from us. Make sure you like this video and show your support as you guys already have. Hit that thumbs up button, we'd really appreciate it. And of course, comment down below if you're feeling the LeBron Soldier 12s, if you've been picking up a pair for yourself, if you've already got a pair, what do you think of them? Because we'd love to know. Follow us on Instagram, at purekicks.it, and on Twitter as well, at purekicks underscore TW. And of course, you guys need to hit that subscribe button so you keep up to date with Pure Kicks. Whether it's our unboxings, our performance reviews, our NBA talks, Hit the red button and the bell next to it to make sure you get notified every time we drop a new video. It's important. We're on our way. Yes. And there's a few things that could be in this video. You have to, the only way you can find out is to watch them. Please. And if you miss the video, then you miss out on what's in the video. So just subscribe. So all right, team, that's it from us. This is the LeBron Soldier 12. We're Pure Kicks. Let's, Let's get, get it. it.